Governor Newsom. Why have you been actively involved in harassing a Christian in a wheelchair? Active in my family, so I take lifeline. The senator at the Senate subcommittee gets right to the point. And uh, Governor Noose, some kind of mumble or something. Big work, Governor, I, handsome ball guy. And uh, he mumbles again when he asks again, and, and he finally says, Oh, I heard that uh, governors couldn't uh, be called before a Senate subcommittee. And then they ask him about connections to ISIS and Taliban because of the nature of harassment of Christian in a wheelchair here in Eagle Rock, Solari Enterprises. And he, yeah, cowardly Hussein out in the audience is doing this, so he takes the fifth. So Harry has a big five on his desk and uh, whenever somebody asks he says uh, here reaches into the drawer he has a couple of paper clips and some tape you got tabletop art desktop art he reaches into the desk and gives them a five laminate the last longer and tells them you make a video of America's Hijack Lifelines. You call up every reporter and network news anchor there is. You try to call Melton in front of, of them. And yes, Father Harry prints out some new fives quite often to protect that flock of his. You should too. So the ER doctor. Corsetti likes spaghetti. He's talking to mom in the hallway. And she says, you're sure there's no hope? And the doctor says, oh yes. But uh, he looks down at that hole in her, her jeans and the ragged clothes and the child in the emergency room has the same condition. And uh, he says, there's no hope, but yes, uh, little Billy can go on if you just, you know, donate the organs. And little Billy calls out from the emergency room there, Mom, don't fall for it. I'm okay. Come get me and take me to a decent hospital other than Dignity Health. So an archbishop is before a Senate subcommittee, and the senator is asking him you've known about Melton John Melton Brady demonstrating America's hijack lifelines for over a decade how many parishioners those of the Catholic Church have brought that to your attention and the Archbishop looks over to the Pope he's uh, there for moral support and the Pope's hand kind of goes up and everybody thinks it's too you know, wipe a bead of sweat away. It's very hot, especially in that hat. But no, it's to wipe away a tear over what has happened to the Catholic Church in America. And the Archbishop looks a little further. And sure enough, there's that cowardly Hussein. Hand up like that, telling him, take the fifth, take the fifth. Yes, that cowardly Hussein feed us hater. Telling him to take the fifth. Take the fifth. The Sandra image, guardian angel, flower grower, and yes, cloud designer as well. And some saints. Kind of extra. I printed them out separate from the months so that uh, yeah, I could have some in a morning.
videos, photo videos, without getting the whole month or happen to come up with a nice talky parable. You can find the saints, saints-imagery.blogspot.com. Download them, print them out, and here's why you you got to have the border on it. You see how smaller up here it is than it is down here? It can go down into the uh, photo, even with the 4x6 frame there. But that's why. Also on it, yes, either side. Come see me. Let me design some imagery around you. Yeah, you got to see me in person. The devil steals your calls. Make a video of that right now. 424-229-4140. And come see the Sample Carpenter and Mary in person. In Eagle Rock, neighborhood in northern Los Angeles. You see someone besides me. These clouds, these flowers, and gold. In my imagery, someone started to tear down that great wall of Chinese evil. Be that somebody. Yeah, stretch it a little bit this way. But let's see how that looks. I don't know what I got on a whole lot of folders, I believe. Say uh, save as Poe says they were right there. Oh, they're in a fast stone program. Then you gotta turn it off. Yeah, I'm working on Trump's phone gate here. Hussein's in Trump's phone gate and a whole lot of other stuff on my desktop. I'll try and get it tomorrow when I can just get started, but yeah, all fives. All Americans, all clergy. Someone asked about your desktop image. Yeah. Give them a nice uh, 4 by 6 uh, photo. Oh, that's the first one I just picked out. Like this, except the... Uh, a big five telling America how to check in post in five. Do that. 424 229 4140. Certified email, not one flight, not three check call or mail in over a decade of asking. Get that on video. Show the reporters and the senators how to do their jobs. Dr. Dignity Keck Advantage. He's at the end of a long day, having lots of other folks do his work for him. And he is speaking into one of those cassette tapes, you know, for someone to transcribe for him. And he's going on about the patient, and all of a sudden there's a knock on the door. Hey, Doc, I got your weed for you. And he gets up and goes to that door and... Gets his uh, his weed, pays the guy, goes back and sits down and continues to uh, uh, transcribe. They're the transcriptionist will have a good laugh about uh, the doc. Larry, Harry, and Barry are golfing, and as they golf, they're three doctors. They're talking about what other doctors are doing. You know, at their office or at the uh, hospital or country club, wherever they might hang out together. And one says, what is that squirrel doing? He's been following us from hole to hole. And I look over at the squirrel. It's got something around its uh, belly. It says, I know what that is. That's that wildlife stuff. They pick them up. They tag them. They put them out there into the wild. It's a golf course, it's not the wild. And yeah, that's a phone. Where in Wadale, the ever present eyes and ears of technology, following those doctors around and finding out what they're up to. Besides an active part in America's high tech lifelines, if they're 
corrupt California, Utah, or Louisiana Catholic doctors. We are at Bio Desire Country Club in Earl, Louisiana, or it could be any country club all across America that Catholic doctors might be at, and it's half empty. And the busboy tells of the waiter or the waitress why it is half empty. It's that uh, we're in Wadeo stuff that Catholic doctors have been requesting for all doctors for a long time. Being active with the Mormon cult and Muslim cult and uh, that kind of thing on American soil. Yeah, everybody's got their audio makers going and saving the audios for the Senate subcommittee. And of course, they, yeah, they don't want to sit next to the doctors. Saints YouTube. Yeah, it doesn't have a custom URL. That's uh, that's this right. Here. Saint Teresa of Calcutta. And this has uh, a lot of videos of the months, a year's worth of month plus a little bit more of Saints photos. You know someone likes the Saints? Go to saintsstatsimagery.blogspot.com download and next time you print out your family's photos you can print them out with them. But yeah, the link's here. Pull by six photos. Let's see if it works. This site may be harmful. Oh, yeah, that's the devil. All right. She hates uh, saints and the truth. And that's a that's a devil lord kind of thing. As I say in a, a lot of uh, truthful parable bites, folks are making documentaries of a lot of angry brunettes and their gay husbands or boyfriends all across America. And they're explaining how they're all spin offs of what's in Lake Charles. Personal knife in the back, hater of truth. Active in America's hijacked lifelines, not one flight 93 check calling over a decade of basking as Lori Ann Brady Bond and her gay husband can reach. I mean, by phone to taunt. Text taunt because I don't answer the phone anymore. And, uh, yeah, that last computer before that broke is only like uh, less than three months old. This is the devil, Lori, and that's her character right there. Go to sight. Yes, it's the devil, Lori. And yes, make uh, videos of all of those angry brunettes with their gay husbands. Samuel Lynn Bond used to work at the, used to work, uh, I don't know what, it's been a decade. And yes, I don't answer the phone anymore, but Lake Charles, where they lived in the middle of nowhere. And yes, all Catholic doctors thank them. I get that, that's beyond bizarre. All Catholic doctors thank them for the Wirum Wadeo. Since this isn't responding, let's go back to there. Go back to safety. Oh, I don't think I ever will be moving. There's what another one, Lori, the devil. There's what uh, Lori, the devil, and Catholics. The Catholic doctors in particular of Louisiana, Utah, and California volunteered. They hated saints so much and 
literally taunted in that lorry. That jumps over that every single time. I'm scrolling and it's not doing it properly. But, uh, yeah. Why in this world? Because they're present eyes and of technologies to so all doctors. As they hand this out and leave them as bookmarks in those magazines after they wait forever for the damn doctor. This is Laurie Ann Brady Bond volunteering this. And every time you look out, look at that. Every time you look out into that waiting room, know that any one of them could be making a video of your character, Doctor. So get that on video. And these folks here in California, Ventus, I'm pretty sure aren't Catholics. Dignity Health, I think they are. And LSE USA Cake Medical. These folks are active in America's Hijack Lifelines. Try to call me with them on speakerphone and tell them to uh, oh, text them, email. This is just me kind of explaining. The devil Laurie and her gay husband met in Glenwood Hospital, from what I understand, and got married to Nalt Park in West Monroe, then moved to the middle of nowhere in Lake Charles, Louisiana, and he's got to work at a hospital down there. His brother is a L.A. DWP in charge of one in 30 Americans water and electricity. So you need to call Cheryl Bond with his Mideast wife, Mo Bond. Pass out their photos, try to call me in front of them. Laurie Ann Brady Bond, her gay husband Samuel Lynn Bond in Lake Charles, Louisiana, as far as I know. And uh, Cheryl Bond out here, and all these adventures. If you come out to California and get sick on vacation or a business trip, you're not going to get, you're going to get the same treatment. I have gotten from doctors. Yes, medical research being passed by. Oh, this part's gone right here. Get a little genetic carpentry very seriously. Medical research being passed by because of these folks and. Let's see if it goes again. It went back to that one. Now, um, I don't have time to design tonight. Six eleven. We got an hour maybe. But this is just beyond bizarre. There. Let's see if I can just type it in since it's been obvious as hell. W. Dot. Saints dash imagery dot blogspot dot com. Look at that, it's gone back to there. Apparently blogspot dot com takes you back to YouTube. Yeah, it's been the Harbinger cult all day. And that's what you get uh, when the devil Lori isn't taunting and hating saints with that message there. This is what you get. And yeah, that's uh, the Flickr. It's supposed to have the Google Drive one, but it's disappeared, I think. Let's take it to Flickr there and. Yeah, download. They're 4 by 6 What they're prepared as? Those are cards. 2 to a 4 by 6 But like this one right here. Oh, no, no, that's not even that. That's another card. Let me see if I can find a single, like, uh, Italia, Saint Italia here. And that's a 4 by 6 photo, exactly. Some will have more over here, some will more over here. The photo printer will crop even a little bit off the top or a little off the bottom, that's why that's there. Download, print me out, next time you print out your family's photos, and... Yes, make that video in front of the devil, Lori. And Brady Bond, her gay husband. Samuel Lynn Bond. Remember to certify your mail, make videos of that, hold up those files. Not in, just in front of uh, folks in Louisiana or Utah, but the Governor Newsom. Catholic Governor. 
active in American Sides Acre Life Plans, hold up this file in front of Governor Newsom. In front of Jewish uh, a Jewish Mayor Garcetti of LA. Oh, look at that. Angels take my truth to the world upon your wings. Girls, you can use blast straps and phones. But to hold up those fives or any of my 93 check imagery in front of Garcetti and Newsom and ask him why are you active in America's hijack lifelines? Uh, AT&T bought Spectrum to arrest Christian in a wheelchair. Don't find that kind of hard to believe? Well, you got the time on your phone. You got my number dialed. You got AT&T's bloody-handed phone gate. Place and cowardly Husseins, among others. And altering phone records to cover up their crimes. Time, date, number dial. Post. Tell everyone else to do the same. Hold up those slides in front of all politicians. Get the truth out of them. I'm Milton, and I'm talking to all Catholics worldwide about uh, them placing that cowardly Hussein fetus hater in our White House, America's White House. Right after we got attacked by a whole lot of cowardly Husseins with 9-11, who was sending a message on the world stage, true believers need to undo that message. Whatever one thing you get when you don't get me, phone ring and every message business signal, not going to be boring. If you need the fireman, police, paramedics, money out of your pocket every day, and that's how they place the cowardly Hussein in our White House. Right after we got attacked by a whole lot of cowardly Husseins. You're calling up countless other Americans to tell them who they should vote for and you get that boring thing phone ringing the air message is a signal that's how they placed I have sinned against you I have sinned against God Yes, those in the pews getting that we're in Wadeo thing going at this Catholic church with Archbishop Gomez there. They're getting a nice audio and or video, who knows, about Archbishop Gomez active in America's hijack lifelines and impersonator industries regarding yours truly. Telling the world about their hijack lifeline for over a decade, not getting one. Flight 93 check call. He's doing a Jerry Falwell, Jim and Tammy thing. Talking all about how he didn't mean to cause so much woe for the Catholic Church. Out of my folder. It's about Rhea's repetitive car trouble, car karma. And it jumped out of this big to join folder. It tells me something about uh, the uh, devil bond and other folks with their car karma and other karma as well as far as the stuff breaking down. Remember, the devil lawyer requested this for doctors. So. As doctors look out into those waiting rooms and don't know who's got that ever-present eyes and ears of technology, thank Lori Ann Brady Bond, her gay husband Samuel Lynn Bond, his gay brother with LADWP out here in California, Cheryl Bond and Moo Bond, his uh, Mideast wife, thank them for the image. So Dr. Armstrong. He's in his empty waiting room talking to the receptionist and he says it's getting out the we're in Wadeo and ever present eyes and ears of technology making for a more honest world and I tell you all the time Catholics of Louisiana, Utah, and California including Governor Newsom 9-11 Flight 93 checking post of five in front of them trying to call me and yes find out what else they're doing and that, uh, one of the few patients comes back in and he says oops I forgot my uh, my phone 
He picks up that uh, Mormon cult cartoon Bible on Armstrong's uh, table there. He left the, accidentally left the audio maker going, and he uh, goes out. So Governor Newsom is at a photo op with Archbishop Gomez, and there are a whole lot of these there, as well as other. Flight 93 check. My livelihood is AT&T, just like yours. Try to call me. It's also our lifeline. 424-229-4140. Make that video of your hijack call to me. And take all that 93 check imagery to those Garcetti and uh, Newsom, both looking for the presidential bids and not doing a thing about the Muslim Solari enterprises with their dangerous Mideast ties harassing a Christian in a wheelchair. Take it. Ask them 24-7 wherever you see them. Why is my phone? My family's wife is not allowed to work as I try to call Mr. Brady. What's your very active part in that, Mayor, Governor? So Governor Newsom is at a photo op with Archbishop Gomez. And there are a whole lot of these there as well as other Flight 93 check. My livelihood is AT&T, just like yours. Try to call me. It's also our lifeline. 424-229-4140. Make that video of your hijack call to me. And take all that 93 check imagery to those Garcetti and uh, Newsom, both looking for the presidential bids and not doing a thing about the Muslim Solari enterprises with their dangerous Mideast ties harassing a Christian in a wheelchair. Take it. Ask them 24-7 wherever you see them. Why is my phone? My family's wife is not allowed to work as I try to call Mr. Brady. What's your very active part in that, Mayor, Governor? Some very serious federal Folks, or perhaps senators, have gone to a news station, Seattle, Washington, and they're asking about David Bros, who went to school with me. And uh, they say, Does anybody have phone video or audio of David Rose? R cheeks real red from kissing the devil's ass. Does anybody have any uh, phone audio or video that we might be interested in? And one of the uh, folks there laughs and says, who doesn't? He's a reporter, especially when reporters are the exact opposite of what they're supposed to be doing. Save it for the Senate subcommittee. No stigmatize. Slowly but surely grown a new pair. Yeah, the dark part, the browner part can be even darker than that. The whitest, tannest part there between the brown and the blue can be darker or lighter. Depending on the day. Yes, I'm molten. I can't do this eye as well because I can't see the screen. Son of a carpenter and Mary. Dad a carpenter worked on skyscrapers. Oh, Mom, Mary Ann. I'm the son of a carpenter, Mary. I get to tell parables. Hear that siren. 9 11, flight 93, check and post, and 5. Make the video. Have you had that call to me? Not one flight 93 check call in over a decade of asking. Get that on video. Save the video for the Senate subcommittee looking into America's high tech lifelines. Call your senator. Try to call me. Get it on speakerphone. Ask them why they're not addressing Randall Stevenson and others. Bloody handed censorship. Bought spectrum to arrest a Christian in a wheelchair. Uh, yeah, me. Governor Newsom why 
Have you been actively involved in harassing a Christian in a wheelchair? Active in my family, so I take a lifeline. The senator at the Senate subcommittee gets right to the point. And uh, Governor Noose, some kind of mumble or something. Big work up near a handsome ball guy. And uh, he mumbles again when he asks again, and, and then he finally says, Oh, I heard that uh, governors couldn't uh, be called before a Senate subcommittee. And then they ask him about connections to ISIS and Taliban because of the nature of harassment of Christian in a wheelchair here in Eagle Rock, Solari Enterprises. And he, yeah, cowardly Hussein out in the audience is doing this, so he takes the fifth. Who best exploded? Be a part of getting the truth out about America's hijack lifelines. Have a whole bunch of them on your desk. Or at least one of these, and then you hand out a whole bunch of them when they ask about our hijack lifelines. It's the reverse camera. It's hard to. Uh, not one button, a three check in over a decade of asking. It's more than just your and our hijacked AT&T livelihoods. It's uh, about the security of your family in America. Get it on video. Tell everyone else to do the same. A governor Newsom of California is at a photo op and they ask him why aren't you doing your job protecting a Christian in a wheelchair why are you doing the exact opposite of your job with those cowardly Hussein placers when else will my family's life will not be allowed to work governor because of what you're doing and the last question is how much are the kickbacks you're getting from the dangerous Muslims of Solari Enterprise, Iranian Muslims. And he fidgets around, looks a little sheepish, and he says, well, I don't know. I'm just waiting for the whole thing to blow over to get that, uh, maybe they'll just up and kill him, those Mormons and those Muslims there. And that's when they get that, he gets impeached. Impeached because you can't reach. Impeached because you can't read. Muslim, Mormon, Catholic, whatever he's supposed to be, he's not doing the Christian thing. He's not doing his job either. The general is visiting his family off base on Sunday. And a man walks up to him and he starts asking him about America's. Uh, Hijack lifelines about dangerous folks with Muslim, angry Muslims, Lori Enterprises taking an active part in America's hijack lifelines as well as AT&T by Spectrum Next Torture as a Christian in a wheelchair. They ask him all about that and he just flies into a rage. Yelling and screaming at the guy. Everybody in the church parking lot is looking at him. And uh, as he makes that video, the man asks the general, Were you this angry, this incompetent, when we got attacked by all those angry Muslims, cowardly Husseins with 9-11?